Hey guys, how's it going? In today's video, I'm gonna do some some reviews of the cars. Here it right here at Carmax. Roll Freeway in Webster, Texas. First off, we'll start with a Volkswagen Jetta. It's a 2011 Volkswagen Jetta. This car has 32,328 miles. This one has power uh, locks windows, mirrors, and manual seats. This car has a parking brake here, and a six-speed automatic transmission with manual shiftability and sport mode. Here's your simple to use climate control, manual dimming rear view mirror, Use your AM FM stereo and CD player. Use your turn signal indicators, fog light controls, your wiper controls. Use your headlight control. Use your trunk release. And use your glove box and a cup holder. Yes, and like I said, this is simple to use climate control. It's a nice car. That's about it for this one now. Use a Honda CRZ. This is one. This is an awesome car. This is something that I've been wanting to. That I've been wanting to do for a long time. This one has power locks, windows, mirrors, and manual seats. It has a six-speed auto transmission with manual shiftability with the paddle shifters behind the steering wheel use your parking brake this car has 6,000 miles 16,000 miles use your cruise control and radio controls located on the steering wheel traction control use simple to use climate use your manual dimming review mirror Here's your MFM stereo with CD player. It's a very nice car. All right, let's get going now. This one has been sold already. We'll do a Kia Forte. This is a 2011 Forte. What the heck? Oh well. And it turns out I, I got to the wrong car. Let's, get, let's go on to the next one. Now for a Mitsubishi Eclipse. This is the GS trim. General Sport. Okay. I love the car. This one has powered locks, windows, mirrors, and manual seats. 
and your traction control, cruise control on the steering wheel, and your six speed automatic transmission with manual shiftability. And in these vehicles, you can also get a manual transmission, a six speed manual. You can just simply use climate control, means your manual dimming or view mirror. has a Rockford Fosgate AM FM stereo with CD player. Your cup holder, you can close that. Is your emergency parking brake. And this button right here will activate the top. Oh, and by the way, this car has 29,138 miles. It's a nice car. Use your passenger airbag warning. This light right here tells you that the passenger's seatbelt is not buckled. Okay. That's it for this car here. There we go. Is a Dodge Journey. Is a 2012 Dodge Journey. This one has 9,571 miles. This one has power locks, windows, mirrors, and manual seats. Need your six speed auto transmission with manual shift. Is your dual zone climate control. Here's your auto dimming rear view mirror. Here's your Bluetooth MP3 hands free calling. Here's your radio controls and cruise control located on the steering wheel. So, yeah, there's your MFM stereo of CD player, which is a touch screen, push button startup. Here's your reading lamps and overhead lights. This is your smoker. Use your storage compartment. Use your front and rear wiper controls, headlight controls, fog light controls, and turn signal indicators. Use your parking brake release. So yeah, this is a nice car. Not a bad car. And for a and of course here's a reject car that people like wanted to see seeing these reject cars. 2002 Mercury Sable. And they've been having it for almost 10 years. See what I mean back here? There's a little bit of a mess in here. This car is not really the best in the world. A couple times, that one doesn't work. Well, yeah, a few times now I had to. I did video. I did a. I did a video of this car before. Which, of course, you're not going to sell it anymore. Alright, let's get a tour out of this thing. The dash shows 58,000... No, 5,043 miles. And, of course, this has power locks, windows, mirrors and manual seats. Use your four-speed automatic transmission with 
Low gear selection. Is your simple to use climate control? Don't know what happened with the AM FM stereo and C and and, and cassette. <laughs> Is your manual dimming rear view mirror? Well, the interior it's in pretty rough shape. Here's your parking brake release, trunk release. Here's your wiper controls, turn signal indicators. Here's your headlight controls and fog light controls. Well, yeah. Ooh, this car is it's pretty, it's got a little bit of damage in the interior. Here's your cruise control on the steering wheel. And that's enough of this one. Yep, that's it for this one. And last but not least, here's a here's a Porsche Boxster. This is a 2005 model. It's a very nice car. It has 34,386 miles. This one has power locks, windows, mirrors, and, and seats. With manual recline. It does have power seats, but it doesn't work. This one has a, a six-speed automatic transmission with manual shiftability with these paddle shifters. The Tiptronic located on the steering wheel. Here's your dome. Here's your driver's. Here's your tire reset. I believe there's your cruise control. No, actually, I was wrong. This is, sorry, guys, that was incorrect. This is actually your radio controls located on the steering wheel. Here's your headlight controls. Here's your turn signal indicators, wiper controls, fog light controls. Your dual zone climate in your Porsche 424 AM FM stereo with CD player. And this car has a Bose sound system and it has a manual dimming review mirror. I don't know. This, and here's your, here's your trunk release and your hood release. I don't know. But yeah. There's two hood releases in this car. So yeah, it's a nice car. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed the, the car reviews at CarMax Gold Freeway, the next installment. Stay tuned for more videos, guys. Thanks for watching.